everybody it's Paul coming back at you with another ride home review and this week I watched Alien Covenant directed by Ridley Scott starring Michael Fassbender uh, Catherine Waterston uh, Danny McBride Billy Crudup and uh, basically the story is about a ship that is set to recolonize a planet and the crew gets awakened uh, due to a, a technical difficulty with the ship and therefore in the midst of that they end up finding a new planet. They hear a transmission and they find a new planet and that's where all the fun begins. So, what, what are the positives out of this movie? I, I thought that this movie really tied up what the confusion was with Prometheus, if you ever saw Prometheus. Uh, I didn't really think that that movie was all that great. Um, really, it's really kind of incomplete. And I think that this really did a, did a nice continuation on that plus some. Um, I, lo I really like the story that Michael Fassbender was incredible as uh, in his role roles I'm not gonna spoil any of the movie for you um, you know and I just I just thought that the tension was there um, I I felt that you know Ridley Scott did a really good job in the direction of this movie the camera work and the editing were were great uh, you know, I mean, there uh, the, the negatives. There were some predictable points. You knew there were going to be some some things here and there. Uh, but I really think that Ridley Scott did take it back to the way the original Alien stories were told. Uh, like the first two, you know, when it came to Alien Three and Alien Resurrection, it seemed to lose its way a little bit. Um, but and this was a was a good. And Prometheus was all right, but this really brought it to a to a good level. Um, really good suspense. But like I said, you you knew some parts were happening. Um, there wasn't anything too gratuitous, but action scenes were great. Alien was was phenomenal. Um, well well done visual effects and special effects. And so this is a really good uh, summer blockbuster movie. Um, um, I didn't think the pacing was slow. I didn't think that, uh, you know, um, other than some predictable parts, uh, you know, and then there were some twists in there, especially with Michael Fassbender's, char Fassbender's character. He was just great. Um, uh, his accent for Walter kind of bothered me a little bit, but that's, that's petty. Um, he did a wonderful job. Of, uh, some things you need to watch for, there's a couple of key A-list, well, you know, A-list actors that are in there that uh, aren't credited right off the bat. See if you can notice who they are. Um, and so, but yeah, I mean, I think that uh, after the King Arthur deb debacle from last week, uh, I think that this is a, a real, if you're an alien fan, I don't think you, you'll be disappointed. Um, uh, with this Ridley Scott went with another strong woman character uh, and I thought she was great. I, I don't recall ever seeing her in a movie before. Um, I don't recognize her but I thought she was great. A, a real uh, a real good compliment to Sigourney Weaver's Ripley from the early Alien movies. So did you see it? What did you think? Don't forget this is going to YouTube. Subscribe it on to us on YouTube, like us on Facebook, all that stuff. Uh, just let me know what you, you what you think about this movie. If you saw it, like, share, and comment on this. Give me your feedback. Until next time, see you next week.